Hello baking monsters and welcome back to my 12 bake of Christmas. As we are getting closer to the big day, it's time to add some fizz to our celebrations, our baking celebrations. And this dessert is refreshing, it's light and it's full of bubbles. It's my champagne sorbet. Cheers. Take 600 grams of mixed berries. Add three tablespoons of icing sugar, one vanilla pod, and the juice of one lemon. Simmer gently on the stove. So while our compote is cooking nice and gently, I'm gonna to start to make the uh, champagne sorbet. If you're gonna make champagne sorbet, you need some champagne. Provide 600 millimeters of champagne. For sweetness, measure out and add 400 grams of golden caster sugar. Add a bit of a kick and zest to our sorbet. I'm going to grate and juice two lemon. So I'm going to take that to the stove now. Just eat it up slightly till the sugar is completely dissolved. So I don't want to take it to the boil because I don't want to lose all the flavor from the champagne. While that's eating, remove the compote from the stove. And look at that beautiful color. You can see all the strawberries still almost in one pieces, but nice and soft. And uh, you get as well the aroma of the sweet vanilla. So I'm just going to leave that to cool down completely and keep an eye on my champagne. Remove champagne mixtures from the heat and make sure it's smooth. Leave it to cool while you start to churn. It's using an ice cream maker. What I'm looking for really is something that's quite slushy and I'm going to serve it straight from the machine. After 45 to 50 minutes, remove the mixture and check the consistency. So here we are, it's just, you can see, that that's exactly how I want it. So because it is a fabulous dessert, I'm gonna get a fabulous glass. Pile the sorbet into a glass in layers and carefully arranging a few berries on the top. Top it up with more sorbet. So here we are, this is almost like a work of art. Even if your guests feel like I can't face to have a dessert or a pudding, when they're gonna be presented with something like that, it's gonna be wow and woo. And look, it's a mixture of beautiful sticky coolies with a compote and that sloshy champagne sorbet. Mmm. I could almost just drink it like this, it's amazing. I hope you enjoy a little touch of freshness in the middle of all the indulgence and richness of our 12 bakes of Christmas. So don't forget to subscribe, to like, to comment, and tell your friends and your colleagues at work. They all must subscribe and they must all go festive baking mad with me. See you tomorrow.